go. Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm uh, here with Zenrot. Hello. Hello. Are you ready for an adventure, an adventure in nostalgia, Zen? As we do what we promised in the hour-long Pokemon video and watch old commercials <laughs> of video games, <laughs> dantily related to video I, I, games. I, I trust that these are all, like, uh, early, like, N64, Game Boy, so, uh, PlayStation 1 era. Yes, these are very specific. So for the people joining us now for today, during a Pokemon video, we, we started talking about a bunch of old video game commercials from the 90s, and I decided to say, hey, why don't we just watch a whole bunch of them and then record it for a video? And then Zen said, hell yeah, the internal hype man that he is for me. So here we are. <laughs> so I I'm was able to... there to see it happen. Hell yeah. So I compiled a bunch of Pokemon ones from, I think, it goes up until the second gen it's an n64 era it does it cuts off right before ruby and sapphire the reason is is that there's actually so many of them that i ran into a problem of compiling them together and i hit my download limit <laughs> for the day so this is the start of it as we kind of just see our way through it as we I mentioned before if you have any specific commercials that you want us to check out we're starting with pokemon here first because i woke up to the news of new whooper whooper so, of course, we're going to watch yes, Pokemon stuff. I'm sure so. you, that was exciting for you. Oh, hell yeah. I woke up to it. It was like when Aureli came back. <laughs> People had added me <laughs> saying, oh, my God, Ooh, I'm so two. happy for you. Yeah, it was as if, it was as if I had announced that I had won the lotto. <laughs> People were so happy for me. So let's go in. Uh, this should start. We'll also be pausing and doing whatever when we need or replay of whatever, whenever we need to do it. Also, the volume for this stuff is going to be all over the place because, oh my god, the compiling of old commercials is a pain in the butt. But let's start. Uh, this is the, we'll just hit play and we'll just start going. This is the original Japanese trailer. This is what we, they originally released in Japan back in the day. Look at that. This is how they decided to introduce Pokemon to the new people. A woman holding a Game Boy to a bunch of old men on the park. <laughs> Look at the old Pokemon, like, sprites. Oh, they're so good. I really want them to do another Pokemon game like that. I know, I love the original sprites, man. Let's go crazy. Oh, this is also for red and green, because back in the day it was red and green in Japan. We got blue. We got the advanced version. Here's the commercial that we talked about a whole bunch. What they played a whole bunch when we were a kid. The the bus, the Pokemon bus commercial. Yes, the Pokemon bus. This is the classic. Yes. Look at this sweaty ass man that they put for this Pokemon. <laughs> they just Pikachu just believed this man and look at the Pokemon. He's compressed. Look at how happy he is. That's my thing. He's like so fucking proud of himself. He is. Also, he made perfectly made a Game Boy in a <laughs> by compiling them all in a bus. Oh, he like put this one a little bit louder. Here's the original Link Cable commercial from back in the day, back when we had to use that Links. Like, that kid looks like Drake Bell. But yeah, I remember this commercial. Too. This kid is also Drake Bell, by the way. Oh, is it Drake Bell? Yeah, it is. <laughs> Before he committed multiple crimes. Before he was a rampant criminal. Yes, before he became Jerry Campana and ran to Mexico, he was actually- Oh, there's the bus driver, too! I didn't even realize he was in this commercial. It's a shared universe. Look who's back. And here, this is the Pokemon <laughs> the, yeah, MCU's got nothing on this. <laughs> yeah, the shared Pokemon commercial universe. This is the original Pokemon Yellow commercial. Once again, why are so many of these Pokemon getting compressed into cards? Okay, Pikachu's helping, though. He is. I actually need to go back and look at how happy Pikachu is at the destruction of his friends. Just real quick. Look how happy this Pikachu is to betray his fellow Pikachu's Pokemon. Like, yeah. <laughs> Get shit on. Oh, that Venonat. He wasn't captured and now he's alone forever. <laughs> he's gonna forever be away from his friends. All of his friends are dead. Okay, that one was just too- Oh, that poor Dragon Knight! <laughs> you put him in a fucking cage! All the other ones got, like, elaborate, uh, elaborate traps, you just got put in a cage. <laughs> I mean, Onyx just got put in a truck. Yeah. Here's the Golden Goose commercial. Do you remember this, what this one was for? Think Pichu. Lugia. Pikachu. I'll be surprised if you I, I assume it's Golden's- Wait, it's gotta be gold and silver, right? Look at this poor goose shitting out a Game Boy. It's for the golden Game Boy. The new collector's edition gold and silver Pokemon Game Boy cover. The Pokemon the true Game Pokemon Boy. The Pokemon Master made you yeah. anything to get it. Well, how about five more for my friends? 
Oh, this poor goose. <laughs> Not happy with the idea of having to shit everything. Oops, I accidentally put this one in twice. Oh, that's fine. We can just see it again. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> see again. Notice the pure joy. Why is Pikachu on his side? And that's what happened. Once you get, once Look at that Venonat desperately <laughs> trying to save his friends. <laughs> but failing because he has no arms. Yeah, look at him. Oh, that Onyx got put in the back of a truck. I mean, that Onyx that could easily escape. Container, yeah. Did you ever have the Pokemon Yellow uh, Game Boy back in the day? This was for the Peggy. No. This Pikachu device. I don't remember. It's like a Tamagotchi, but uh, the pocket Pikachu, Pikachu thing. Yes. Yeah. So, did you ever have one of these? Yes. Me too. I had one of these back in the day. I do not remember this commercial for it though. I just remember there was a new Pikachu thing. No, I don't remember this commercial either, but I remember the toy. Yeah. Hopefully none of these anime clips, which are featured throughout all these, get my channel taken down. Which Pokemon has bumpers and flippers? Oh, for a second there I thought it was Kyra speaking, but it's not. Is this, this Pokemon is Pinball? Yeah, it's Pokemon Pinball. Yeah. <laughs> pinball. Now with his own Rumble feature, I actually love the new way to catch I love Pokemon Pinball. Ed has been disgust. The original Pokemon Pinball goes crazy hard. Yeah, I don't remember why this is here. I think this is just a part of someone else's video. They put Batman there at the hey, end. Hey, Batman! <laughs> Get out of here. You don't want to Here's play. the Pokemon TCG. Video game? I love that game too. Oh, this game's so good. I'm so sad we never got this. Game goes fucking crazy. I know. There's a um. There's translated ROM on the game, game for Game Boys. Yeah. You can learn all Look at them fucking up those cards. They have no fucking. Master Trainer for everyone. <laughs> yeah, the, no all those folks. None zero. All those kids are playing with like million dollars cards and completely destroying them. Limited edition cards. I know. <laughs> they, if you think of, if you look at that commercial for that uh for that sense, look at the value that was in that commercial. <laughs> Clearly of millions. I believe this Pokemon is Snap, true. gotta be. Gotta yep. be. You're gonna be yep, that that fucking is. Squirtle, <laughs> 3D Squirtle. <laughs> this was the, the, the cutting edge 3D graphics for the No, you don't. All you need is Pokemon Snap, the first Pokemon game Look for that. N64. Yeah, that I love Pokemon Snap, them, too. And shoot. You can even bring your Snap cartridge to a participating Bro, Pokemon goes so hard. <laughs> yeah, I love Pokemon Snap. Did you ever do that? Did you ever print your Pokemon Snap Pokemon stickers out? No, em. I couldn't find one by the time I that they were doing it. I didn't either, but I wanted to. What is this Batman project? I don't know. This must be all from a specific guy that I took and very quickly put together. Same Pokemon Snap commercial again? I think this one might be slightly different. So yeah, this one has a little bit more stuff in it. Great pictures. That's the name yeah, this one doesn't have any of the Blockbuster promotion on it. Oh, no, it does. Right there. Yeah, it does. I always looked at these wanting to do it. Oh, this is for the concert. For the, uh, for the contest. You can go to Australia. Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> Let's talk about how this contest to go to Australia is actively would have probably hurt some kids because Australia is a, <laughs> a terrifying place to send a child. <laughs> I'm sure it's supervised. They probably go with their family or something. Oh, you don't think they don't just immediately drop them in the middle of a bunch of... <laughs> no, I'm sure they don't just, like, thing. hurl them into the fucking... The wild. I would do that. Yeah, now, out to the nowhere. Now be a true trainer. Shot wins an Australian safari uh, for and you know, and there's lots of other great No, prizes. nothing, nothing but respect for our actual Australians, but even they admit it's kind of a hellscape. Pokemon Snap, take your best shot. With all the, there he is again. Hello, Batman. Batman like again. Back again. It's like his call. Gotta go to the mall. Gotta go to the mall. Like I, do. I don't remember this commercial. Pokemon at all. Stadium tour. This is the Pokemon 2000 too. Stadium Tour. Okay. You can compete for a Pokemon Stadium. And yeah, you can compete for a brand new yes, Pokemon, for Pokemon Stadium. stadium. For Fuck! I love all of these games, dog. Make sure you bring your own Game Boy and Game Pack because Fuck. we're giving away the rarest Pokemon of all. You remember when you had to actually go to places to get your Pokemon? Yeah, <laughs> like to get Mew. Yes, I remember there was a story of someone who. I'll pause it here to tell the story of what we look at Batman. This is a story of someone who used to work at a Toys R Us and they'd have to transfer in a um, a Pokemon to make room for the Mew. He ended up having to delete a Pokemon that he had there to make room and it ended up being a Mewtwo. <laughs> and he ended up destroying the kid's Mewtwo. <laughs> And I remember the people, he's like, my Mewtwo. And he's like, oh, sorry, kid. I'm very sorry, but there was literally no room. Whoops. <laughs> yeah, that, that was basically what he said. Whoopsie. I made a whoopsie doodle with that one. Did you used to have Pikachu Hey You Pikachu here. back in the day? No, Hey You Pikachu is one of the ones I did not have. I had Hey You Pikachu. And I used to say swears at the Pikachu. 
Pikachu. Fuck you, Pikachu. Yeah, eat shit, Pikachu, and then he'd be like, Pika. This true. It was basically like Seaman before Seaman came out. I have no idea what this game was actually supposed to be about, though. <laughs> I think there's. I a assume plot. it was supposed to be like just like a. There was a plot. I thought it was just like a pet game. So yeah, there is a plot. Hey, it's my virtual pet. You think so, but you're supposed to be like doing something with the Pikachu. Like here, with the Bulbasaur, you're supposed to be making soup. But every time I would tell Pikachu, like, hey, pick up that yam, that would look good for the soup, he would, like, fucking go, like, hit me with a thunderbolt or something. Like, you can see here, he doesn't understand. And then eventually it would get to the point where you had to do this mini game where you had to shoot, like, bubbles at Pikachu in order for him to understand you, because he stole your actual Hey You Pikachu device. It was a hell of a game. It's hey you, Pikachu. It's a crazy thing Dude, to think that this was released on an N64. Look at that first, giant microphone one that one you can see on the N64 too. Pikachu to trust you. Things like that don't just happen. I overnight. think people have also emulated Dude, so uh, hey you Pikachu that you can actually use it for uh, PC patience now. Once you get crazy. To trust you, oh, you watered the Oddish. Giant. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Holy shit. And having yeah. picnics or going yeah. fishing. This game is so confusing. That this commercial Pikachu is two is minutes long to trying to explain it's what you do in Hey You Pikachu. It's just like having a pet without the litter box. Has anyone seen my good barbecue tongs? Oh no. Whoops. He used say? the tongs no, for shit. <laughs> Pick up shit. Now mom wants it. It's Hey You Pikachu. God, there's so much 90s in this specific <laughs> commercial, it's killing me. And he actually listens. Watch. Pikachu, carrot. You see, like, if you actually tried, to, he doesn't listen to you. There you go. See, he couldn't even get Pikachu to fucking carry the thing. He ignored him. Maybe Pikachu's a she. Whatever. Yeah, I remember this game having this problem. Everyone was like, "Yeah, I don't really know how to get Pikachu to fucking do anything." Patience. It's all about patience. See, this kid keeps saying, "You gotta be patient, okay?" Pikachu is just kind of a dick. He'll do whatever he wants. Pikachu just does whatever the fuck he wants. Yeah. And of course, your new best friend. I played a lot of hours in this game. Maybe more than one should. Pikachu. Now, yeah, yeah, here you yell at a Pikachu to try and play with a pinata. <laughs> this, <laughs> <laughs> this, <laughs> this was the height of video games back in the day. Just say, hey, you, Pikachu. Can I play now? Get your own game. Pikachu, let's play. Pikachu. There you go. Hey, you, Pikachu. Loved it back in the day. Played too much of it. Let's see, what is next here? Uh, Attention all Pokemon trainers. This is for... On November 12, Pokemon, I don't remember what this is for. Oh, this is a Pokemon the first movie, movie promo. Screening of Pokemon the first movie for you and your yeah. class. Yeah. Plus, an system, Approximate Boy retail Boy value $2,700. What is going on for this? What the hell is that robot thing, actually? Let me go back, because I don't understand. I was pretty okay with the commercial so far, but I want to know what that robot thing was. An N64 system, Game Boy Color, and Pokemon games. Just tune into YTV Smith Station Saturday and Sunday from now until. What is this? <laughs> this must be not from our country because I don't recall this thing. Have you ever seen anything like this? This is the monstrosity of a robot? Uh, no. No? Okay. This must be from Australia or something, I think. I think that's where it said I got November it from. To find out how. You could also win one yeah. of Pokemon the first movie I also remember Game going Boy to, Color, which includes Pokemon Yellow, to the theater to go watch. Game. Is over. I think my mom fell asleep for it, and then she also did the same thing to me. Oh yeah, this match. is for <laughs> the actual uh, contest for for the for tournaments. Oh, the like go there tournaments. Yeah. Wicked, fucking awesome. <laughs> To find out more about the Pokemon Trading Card Game League, log on to Wizards. I don't think I ever learned how to play Pokemon Trading Card Game until like many years later. Or no, it wasn't until I played the Game Boy game. But then by that point, I was like, "There you go, thank you, Fan Productions, for that amazing uh, VHS oh, Red. This is for You've this is the start of um, Pokemon Gold and Silver, I think. You've caught them yeah. all. Look at this kid. He thinks he's big shit because he has all three games and was able to beat them. <laughs> I love when this game came out. Back in the. Fuck that shit in that other kid. Holy yeah. fuck. Have I ever told you the story of how I got Pokemon Gold? No. Okay, so I had to pause it for this one. Let me go back. 
so at least we see the kid on the Lugia while I tell this story. Um, so when I went to go get Pokemon Gold, we ha- we used to buy a lot of our Pokemon things from a place called Kitty World, which was right next to the um, Toys R Us, and it had a whole bunch of like. Um, it had a bunch of Pokemon. It was a bunch of Hello Kitty stuff, but also had like a lot of Japanese products in general. So we went over there to get Pokemon Gold. And while we were there, I was like, oh, happy. I was getting it. Yay, yay. And then when we were going back inside the car, it was not the greatest neighborhood that we were in. The person, there was a person nearby and she said, excuse me, as, as we were getting into the car with me and my mom, um, she said, excuse me, can you give me a ride to the hospital? I need to see my child. And then my mom immediately realized something was wrong. <laughs> and she said, <laughs> no. And she immediately said, okay, come on, uh, Wokey, get into the car. Very quickly, it was like rushing me into the car. But then my dumbass was like, no, this is a Samaritan in help. My church teaching tells me we have to respect all people in the world. <laughs> what, if, what if there's a child in danger? And then she very quickly said, <laughs> getting in the car and then the second i got into the car she put her arms over from where i was crazily closed the door and then locked the door because the lady was already going for the inside of the car as we were going inside with my pokemon gold (laughs) and on that day i learned to not always trust people (laughs) at their words (laughs) because then she told me what a day a crazy day because I, I was still like she really in my mind as a kid I was like she really wanted to get into the car she must have really needed to see her child and my mom was just very much like listen son there are people in the world who lie <laughs> and that person was probably lying and I said but what if they weren't lying and it was like well that's the thing of the world you're just gonna have to accept that if it, if she was telling the truth Oh, well, but we're just going to have to accept that for the time being, she was in fact lying. And then I went to go home and play Pokemon Gold, and it was a fantastic day. And then years later, I was like, holy shit, I almost caused us to get us have our car stolen. <laughs> there you go. There's <laughs> All for Pokemon. All for Pokemon. So there you go. There's my Pokemon Gold story. <laughs> Did you on board? Great ass game, let me tell you. This is for Pokemon Crystal. I'm pretty sure. Unlock the mystery of the unknown. What do you think those strange workings mean? Just help me push. I've never seen this Pokemon Crystal. Oh, is that supposed to be the unknown? Yeah, the ruins of Alf. Yep. Should we tell him it says pull, and then you see right there it says pull. Pokemon Crystal. Gotta catch them all. Batman's back again. Batman. Batman loves Pokemon. He does. I love the '90s animated series. This is for Mastermind? Oh, I know what this is for a specific toy. Can you guess what toy it is by the end? Two feet four inches. How does he do it? I guess I've seen this commercial before. The Pokedex! <laughs> the Pokedex, remember this? Yes, I had one of these. I loved that thing. Me too. I also loved it from back in the day. There's so much stuff. So around this time, I, oh, I realized into the... This is for the first Pokemon movie. Yeah. Uh, Rhyme has it PSA 10 somewhere. This is a random ass YouTube card from a VHS. This is the Burger King commercial. Do you remember all the Burger King toys from back in the day? Yes. I don't remember this part of the commercial at all. <laughs> I don't remember them doing this weird bit. The walk through the Pokemon town? <laughs> yeah, I don't remember that. I do remember all of the toys, though. God, I would want one of these now. If they were in better quality, that is. Yes. The Burger remember King the gold kids cards? Meal. It has yeah. more of the green I don't think I had the Pokeballs. I, I had the Poly Not Ball. I think Poly Ball was the only one we something could else your kids may enjoy. I have a Charizard one still. Okay. That's the only one I still have. That's not uh, Now inside every Burger that King fat Big Pikachu. Kids oh, that's, <laughs> your kids that's not the... Only bro, the I miss Fat Pikachu. Big kids Free meal. him. It has more of the John great Pikachu. tasting food see. your kids love. Closer look at the glory. Fat Pikachu. Your kids may enjoy. Look at him, he's in there with a polywag. Okay. Then the kids rush because they know the now is close. Every... Oh, look at that. Right next to a Charizard. Big kid. That's what Pikachu was deep inside for all of us. A giant kid. I'm so sad we don't see Chongshu anymore. I know, they made him skinny. They skinnied the boy. They did. They need to ch- re-chonk the boy. <laughs> they need to. 
<laughs> we have to have a, con- a campaign. I'm tired of these campaigns complaining about, oh, this Pokemon got skipped, put all the Pokemon in. Fuck that. I'll gladly trade 500 Pokemon if it means the return of Fat Pikachu. <laughs> Burger King Big Kids meal you buy, your kids not only get more of the great tasting food they love, they get meals. Pokemon toys and limited edition trading cards from Pokemon I remember, the first I, I movie. Got these two. Pokemon and awesome the Burger King Big these. Kids meal. Come and catch them all. King, so yeah, rem- the remember when there was a recall for them, the <laughs> for these Pokemon? Yeah, the plastic Pokeball, because kids were like, yeah, I remember that. They would put it over their lips and suck on it, and it would suction around their mouth. And they would fucking It's very sad, but yeah. I'd be surprised if you realized what this is a commercial for. Macaroni and cheese. Mm. It's gotta be. It this is not like the Pokemon that. Craft. Uh, There's a ball of fun it is in fact. Yes. Spaghetti. It's Heinz Pokemon. Pokemon, 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 Pokemon which I've never. Oh god! <laughs> the combination <laughs> of Pokemon pasta. No! No! I've been turning to pasta. <laughs> Help me. I hereby declare to the Pokemon of the world. This I put at the end be here because this was actually trainer, the original. The um, Pokemon Master. This is how they That's introduced the Pokemon. Dog. Is that what like it's clocked? That capturing a Pokemon. Yes, this was so. This was back skill. when they actually tried to real introduce strategy. Pokemon before it hit big. And Ash has always showed determination in class. Do I think he's got? We have to teach to people what a Pokemon is. Be a Pokemon was. Master. Yes. Yes, I do. This guy thinks I think Ash, Ash could be cut a Pokemon. Oh man, oh my god. Pokemon he guessed so Ash wrong on that one. He should have never bet huge on Ash. <laughs> hey, that bet paid off 23 years later. <laughs> 23 years later. I want to see a follow up of that guy. Won eventually. <laughs> 23 years later, that guy watching Ash win and a single tear rolls down his eye. <laughs> <laughs> See, they're trying to explain to the kids what Pokemon is. I love the old Pokedex voice. Yeah, it is. It's very good. Oh, look like at this amazing Nintendo Power outfit. <laughs> Back when they actually included a strategy guide inside the Nintendo Powers. That was the day it came out. Collecting is the key. The more monsters you collect, the better trainer you will be. So if you read the inserts and watch the shows, you'll have what it takes to be a great Pokemon master. I would it's doubt. It's on you, Trey. Prepare to lose, Troy. And that's not all. This is Pocket Pikachu. <laughs> so much stuff. Pocket Pikachu. Give that's it right. gifts. Even watch it. This was a VHS that you could get know there are promoting to you Pokemon what to buy. <laughs> they just don't do this really stuff anymore. More adorable than Nowadays, Pikachu? they just sponsor a streamer and say, Tell I them to play Raid so. Shadow Legend. We don't need to this tell them. <laughs> card game. Playing this card game could help you finesse your Pokemon training skills and yeah. then show them off in battle with others. Yeah, I'm kid, if you want to be the ultimate Pokemon, Pokemon trader, you need this Zubat plush. Wait for the you need it more. <laughs> Stay tuned. You gotta watch Monday through Friday starting September Start 7th. Start watching the show and as well. And be sure to look on your video's mailing label for the Pokemon TV Showtime and Station. And... Oh, that must be the Poke Car. And be sure to watch out for the it Poke too. Car. Ten Poke Cars will be cruising oh, around giving away lots of Ten free Pokemon stuff. Ten Pokemon Cars will be unleashed on the nation. <laughs> Never to recover. www.pokemon.com this is a hell of a house day. It's about strategy. Gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all. Remember, you gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all. Pokemon. I believe that is it for now. Ah, shit. Okay, let me just put Whoa. it back on here. So that's the start of it. I will com- start complying on more for them to be much longer. I actually have a second thing to see that is much longer, but I wanted to see. I don't know how that one's going to work out because apparently there's some weird copyright stuff, but we'll see what we can manage from that one. But yeah, that's the start for this commercial thing. It's very fun to look back at these then. <laughs> see them Man, again. Man, I remember when these were on TV. Yeah. And now there's... N- I don't know what any commercials are playing on that TV nowadays. Not even on the internet, because I'm, even on the internet I have Adblock on. So <laughs> I don't even know what... <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Do you have a second set built for a follow-up, or do we need to find more commercials? Because I know some I- fucking good ones. 
Yeah, there's some more, but we'll. I'll, I'll, I found something else, something else to look at. So we'll be back with some more. All right, everyone. But thank you very much for watching this first video. We'll see you back for some more uh, commercial looking. Say goodbye, Zen. Hell yeah! Goodbye, everybody. <laughs>